Technically, the birthday of this game is in a week, but Nadeo is celebrating early, which I am all for. Dark Link has been a saint for what we're about to do today. He's helped me set up so that I can play the oldest Strike Mania game. This is gonna be nostalgia. You guys are gonna wanna hear this. You guys are gonna, he gonna wanna hear this. The, the soundtrack in this game? <sighs> All right, we're getting in. Wait, wait. <laughs> Hang on a second. Okay, you guys can't really see the opening cutscene. But this is what the game looks like. This is kind of insane. You have, uh... Solo multiplayer multiplayer network edit the challenge view a replay shop settings and credits. What's kind of insane is like even in 2003 they had a replay system. But yeah, I think I'm gonna start a timer and hop into solo and play some tracks. This is how the original Trackmania looked. It's um the Alpine environment, later called Snow. And uh, <laughs> yeah. This car is very responsive, very sharp turning. As you can see. And Stadium would not release for another three years after this. And there's a cool guitar riff, you hit Automel. Did I not beat the Automel? I missed it by a hundredth. Oh. <laughs> I lost to Hylus 20 years ago. Let's see if we beat it here. Yeah, that should be good. Wait, I'm also trying analog keyboard here. To be a smooth steering, because a lot of these old environments, though you can beat every ultimate ever on a keyboard, they're actually a little better on analog devices. Um, hmm, did I do it? <laughs> This, I don't know if it has Automel. It's 1980. <laughs> okay, thanks. All right. That makes me feel really good about my uh, Trick Mania skills. Thank you, thank you. This game does have Automels because I remember there's like a, a cool guitar riff. Yeah. Oh yeah! Unbelievable! You just beat Nadeo's high score! In Trickmania, you get this like... Clank sound? Here they just give you a straight up like... Von Halen solo. <laughs> Can you drift? So in this environment... Keeping... Full grip is the best thing you can do. So you actually want to be very gentle. With the steering. The more the car goes like fully sideways and stuff, the, the slower you are. Now, I'm no snow expert. I've barely played snow in my life. But, um... You want to be pretty pretty smooth through these turns. That carries a lot more speed than if you... Steer sharply. That's what I know about this environment. Bronze, silver, gold... No author metal. Oh, I missed it by a few hundredths. Okay. I like- I like the display of the ghosts in this game, though. Like, just that silhouette of the car. It's very clean. I think it's maybe the fact that it has no skin that I really like. Like, it's just a ghost. Unbelievable! Now let's go map number three. How many tracks are there? I actually don't know. Uh, but... There's like... Basically they released this game in 2003. And then they later like ended up polishing a lot of it. Uh, when releasing Trackmania Original. In 2005. Is my understanding. They also released something called Trackmania Power Up in 2004. Which is like a stepping stone. Alright. Not getting this uh, first try. In every Trick Mania, like, these are called environments in the game. In every Trick Mania environment, you have someone who's just grinded it a bunch. I think reducing airtime there is what we were missing. Airtime in this game seems particularly bad. Does Riola have records here? 
Uh, he actually used to have them, yeah. Really used to have them, but they were also found to be... Uh, illegitimate. I'm faster. This is over. It's Jover. That's your childhood? I wish I got into this game this early. I might be a world champion if I got a Trick Mania already here. Is the entire uh, game the same car? Is it? I think not. I think these first ones are all snow. I believe Desert's one of the original environments as well, but we'll see. I think the first nine are all this car. Ooh, Ooh. transitional, goddamn Nadeo. Look at this mapping. Ooh. I think this is a cool map. I need to uh, improve by a little bit. I've only really played Stadium in my in my ten years of playing, but there's so much more to Trick Mania. I see people asking if I'm gonna do like a full playthrough of every Trick Mania game ever, and I don't think so. But it could be cool. I don't know. If you want to see it, let me know. It's going to be a long project. It would be a very long project to play through every Trek Mania game. And get like, all the medals and stuff. Um, okay, so we beat all the medals here. Now if I go back, we have Race B. If Race A was so good. If, if all the Race A maps were so good. Uh, why is there a Race B map? Well, it's because it's a new environment. Can I get a Keiko and a clap, everybody? <laughs> Yeehaw! <laughs> Out on the prairie. Driving my sports car. Nothing to see but the Great Canyons. Oh. I sure remember this map has a really cool shortcut. I've seen I've seen YouTube videos of the shortcut. <laughs> okay, first of all, this car is extremely heavy. Like compared to the uh, car we just played, this is like trying to drive an ice cream truck. But that being said, it also flows very nicely because it like starts tilting and stuff when you steer. I didn't beat Nadeo. You have to be kidding. Okay, a bit slow, but I can full sum this ending, I believe. That was such a hard other metal. <laughs> oh my god, Nadeo, relax. The hell? Unbelievable, he beat the other time? No way. I think you want to get this downhill. Oh, and that booster, surely. Look at this wobble though, is this not cool? They, uh, in the top records, they use this a lot to, um, reduce airtime, and they keep, like, one set of wheels on the track, and the rest just, like, cuts the corner. Yeah, Virtual, what do you think about the difficulty of Tindril Sage Swift in the RWF? Should it be nerfed? Um, I've had a lot of time to contemplate this. And I think 
Just hearing that sentence, you should go outside. Because it doesn't sound like anything to be upset about. What even is that? Oh, dude, this car is uncontrollable at high speeds. I've never even realized. One hundred coppers. Okay, I should definitely grab that booster. Especially since Hylus is apparently a desert god. Because I think I think what I'm realizing is there's like a speed threshold where if you exceed like 210, 220-ish, and you try to do a turn, this car wants to tilt. And so if you slow down just before it hits that and you keep full grip, you'll do better. It's gold. Ooh, unless you have a lot of space, then like 230 might be fine, but yeah. So like here I need to slow down. It has the the TMNF grass sound. It was very, very jarring. Just gotta bring out the guitar. Sit by the fire. Tell some stories from the farm. Out on the prairie. Get the harmonica out. Oh, what a turn. Get smoked. Nadeo. These are taking me like 10 to 15 minutes per Authorheim. This is 20 years ago, 2003. Oh. Oh, you can jump to the, I think directly to the left side road there. Can you go here? No. 20 years ago, 2003? That's kind of crazy. Sometimes I will see chatters with usernames that end in like... 2009. And then I'll be like, shit, they're actually allowed to be here. <laughs> they're not too young. <laughs> they can- they- they are legally allowed to be on Twitch. <laughs> And it's cool that you want to be here. Don't get me wrong. Hey. Yeah. Oh. But to the people that have played it, is there also rally in this game? Is the rally environment in this game? Okay, and I need gold medals and all tracks, right? Because seeing as we're a bit short on time before the update, I might just... get all the auto times very quickly. Race C1. Oh my god, this is so peaceful. Lo-fi Trackmania rally beats to relax to. Okay, that's... Oh, this soundtrack I've heard before. Here I actually think I need... <laughs> it looks like the car is floating. So, this car, if you don't know it, it's like the most drift-heavy car in the game. If you just steer a little bit, do you see this? You go into a turn, boom! You know, like th this thing has a high propensity towards sliding. And a lot of the top records actually use something called DX Tweak where they limit their controller's steering range to uh, a small amount so that they can perfectly do all these no-slides. Um, that might sound a lot like what some guy did with 34% steering on his keyboard that they have been doing for years, but here it's actually allowed and no one gives a flip, so. Ooh. 
finish. This sounds like uh, the, the window sound. The 34% rule is grandfathered in, you didn't play this game, so if it's... So it's against the rules for you? I don't get that. The 34% thing? Would be like, the same thing as here. Except they made it illegal after I did it. And beforehand it was just cool technology. And I give it, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a prediction on this. I give it like less than three years, Nadeo's gonna revert their changes. Less than three years. Every keyboard company is making analog features and we are backwards for... Uh, for, for preventing the use of it in certain ways. It's happening in Osu, it's happening in uh, Fortnite, happening in a lot of shooter games like Apex where these keyboards give an advantage, it's just gonna be competitively viable. And a lot of big manufacturers like SteelSeries and Razer already are making analog keyboards of their own. It's not just off, off companies. If this, is a, if this is truly allowed, I wanna see what we can do with the analog keyboard. Hey, it's all fair in this game. I wonder what curve I wanna use today. I'm thinking something like 30%. Now guys, I don't know, know what the update is. And if, if I knew, I couldn't tell you. Uh, but I could only suspect it would be cool. I've leaked one thing and the one thing I know is now that you'll want me to build a map. Or they asked me, can you build a map? And I said, yes, I can build a map. Huge, racy two. More rally. Oh, is that? Guys, I need to update my steering. It's different for dirt. <laughs> uh. They actually didn't say anything about the quality of the map. I think I can build whatever I want to. Ooh. But obviously you don't want to, you know, Don't want to embarrass the boss. That's an instant author model. Uh, if I did a marathon, it would take ages. It would take literally ages. Since I'd have to learn all the environments along the way. It could be fun though. It really, um, I think, tells the story of the game as you play them. We'll see. I have no uh, immediate plans of it. But if you guys want to see it, let me know. Maybe it's something we could do. I just think, I just think the way I would do it would be playing the games. You know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't a hundred percent complete every single thing in all the games. That would be mostly for me to play and see the games. Like here, my goal is not to complete Trackmania original. It's just to see what we had. And the same with like Trackmania Turbo. I'd like to see Trackmania Turbo. I'm not going to beat all the 200 STMs. Puzzle mode is a game mode I really want to see brought back. And people have brought it back through plugins, but like, I'd actually like to see it officially added. Okay, nice. I think we'll call it. I think we'll call it for the regular races, but let's check puzzle mode. Uh, this is a kind of unique uh, unique game mode. Basically, puzzle mode, you're given start, finishes, and checkpoints, and your goal is just to make a route. Your goal is to make a route and then drive the target time they've set in the game. Uh, I don't actually know how to place blocks. And <laughs> Wait. Oh. You hold spacebar. Yeah, so now I'm drawing a nice path here. And then I can play it. And this is probably a pretty easy one, but these get way more complex. 
I beat Nadeo's time. All right, that's cool. Oh, can I just... <laughs> they already built the track so nicely, but maybe we can just... Uh... Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Unbelievable! Uh, okay, so new map. We need a booster for sure. Out of stock. Okay, that's fine. What? Oh. And then let us add a small. Oh. A race. This is actually what I wanted to show you guys earlier. Let me drive a straight line here. As best I can. Oh, I'm missing. Uh, let's see. This should probably make it to the road. Ah, missed a bit. Yeah, this is ice in the first checkmate game. If you drive in a straight line, this is slower. I might not have been able to show it that well on the other map. But this is, uh... Significantly? Yes, yeah, so I only got gold here, right? But now look at this. You said I'm just gaining speed? <laughs> and I didn't beat it, but yeah. If you just stay th sideways, you get uh, more speed. Oh, nice. I don't remember the exact angle, but it's something like this. Wait, they're fast. This is it. I just stay like this, and I win. Woo! Ice SD, <laughs> yeah, we got <laughs> It's crazy. Guys, that was a fun game. That was a really fun game. We, we might check out more of the, the old Trek Mania games, actually.